Hello, this is John. I'm getting ready to do my uh, SHTF box opening. Uh, this is Maze. Now, unfortunately, in April, uh, due to a credit card issue, I, I wasn't able to get it last month. Uh, but here's May, and I'll go ahead and open it up, and we'll see what's inside of it. Okay, here it is. We'll go ahead and see what's inside of it. There we go. Let's see here. Um, alrighty, pull that back. Of course, we always get the paper, my favorite thing. Okay, let's see here. Well, let's dig in. Now, this looks pretty cool. Let's see what this is. It is a Death Before Dishonor Warhounds two-piece set. Now, that looks pretty cool. Okay, I'm going to open that up so we can see what that looks like. That's pretty awesome there. Okay, I... I opened it up here. This is pretty awesome. Uh, here it is right here. I'll go ahead. It's a really nice sheath. Good sheath here. Uh, it's got two knives in it. Um, let's see if I can do this one-handed. Uh, here is the bigger knife. Really cool. Good handle. It says Death Before Dishonor on it. Let's see here. Got a decent edge. I could work on that though. Uh, so there's that one, and then it's got another one here. This is really cool too. Here's what it looks like. Got a piece of paracord there. Awesome. Now that's a cool knife right there. All right. That's definitely a good one there. We'll put this down here. We'll see what else we've got in here. Um... A safety lock camping saw. This is always good for uh, uh, whether preparedness or for camping. Uh, camping saws are always come in handy. So that's good. I'll throw that in the bug out bag. Um, let's see what this is. It says Black Legion. The back of it says Black Legion. Hmm. Let's see what's inside of it. Hmm. Oh, I know what this is. It's for uh, like a self-defense tool. You use it like that. Pow. C c similar to like a set of brass knucks. A little bit different though. That is awesome. I've actually thought about getting one of these before. Something similar. That's cool. I like that. Alright, good. So far so good. This is a good month. Um, oh, I know what these are. These are those P-38 can openers uh, that they use in the military. Yeah, that's what that is. Those are always good to have for uh, opening cans. Okay, that's good. Um, what's this? I don't know what that is. Let's open it up here. Um... Oh, I know what these are. Um, when I was in the army, we used to use these on our uh, our backpacks. Though they weren't called backpacks, they were called rucksacks. And these were like used to attach things to your rucksack. I forget what these are called, but I remember I remember using these. That's cool. That's good to have. Um. What's this? Is this an MRE? Just add water. Ready to eat in minutes. Mmm. Cheesy lasagna. That'll be good. That's cool. All you gotta do is eat, add water to it. Oh, I guess it's got its own heater in it too. No, you gotta boil four cups of water. But still, that's pretty cool there. Oh, definitely. I'm gonna eat that. Um, water purification tablets. That is always good. That's always important in a survival situation. We got that. Um, what's this? Oh, okay. This is the paper for those uh, water purification tablets, the Aqua Tabs. Again, that's always good to have. All right. Here is the paper for this month. Um, let's see here. What's in the box? This is the basic box. 
We got a P51 survival can opener. Um, we have two pack Alice clips. That's what they're called, Alice clips. Um, we got a camping saw. That's always good to have. We have the Warhounds two two knife set. That was cool. Um, we got the survival food entree, the Punisher skull self defense Kubaton. That's I think that might be my favorite thing because I've been wanting to get one of those or something very similar to it. And uh, last but not least, here we've got the ten pack Aqua Tabs water purification tablets. Now, this is the basic box. Uh, they've also got a pro box and an a elite box. Um, the pro and the elite box, they have everything that the basic box has, but, uh, also, uh, but other things also. Now, uh, I paid uh, $19.95, or excuse me, I paid $19.99 for this box. And the retail value is $49.63. So I definitely, definitely got a good deal on that. Um, let's see what this is. This is the SHTF Survival Tip of the Month. If your flintlock lighters have run out of fuel, keep them because you can still use them to make fire. There's usually cotton inside these types of lighters. I didn't know that. Take it out and use the flint to create a spark. The cotton inside is usually dry enough that it will catch fire easily. Very interesting. I didn't know that. Well, anyway, here's this box. We've got a lot of good stuff in this box this month. And until next time, bye.